Hey everybody, I decided to do a little video of a wolf I carved over the weekend. Some more serious leather carvers may pull their hair out at how I went about it, but occasionally I do this super simplistic style of carving when I don't want to spend hours on a project. I also figured I'd put the winners of my holiday contest in this video. I'd like to thank everyone for participating in my first ever giveaway. I loved reading all the comments. Remember that I don't have a giant product line or anything. My shirts are men's small to extra large, and I'll be in touch with the winners. I chose one winner randomly, and one winner after reading all the comments. So my random winner is Chemical Life. Congrats, I'll be in touch with you. And my comments winner is Janice Rochester. Thanks for the lovely words. So now on with the video, which I'll probably end up commenting on sparingly. Enjoy. I do a couple of passes with a sponge, then usually let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes. I want it to be wet, but not so wet that the leather doesn't mold nicely to my stylus, cuts, and stamps. Practice makes perfect. One tip today with using your swivel knife is don't be afraid to start a cut deep and then draw it shallow to make a line that changes width. Other than that, try and keep it as straight as possible and be patient. So most people use a beveling stamp to go around these edges. It can be a bit painstaking and take a long time to do. I sometimes use a spoon stylus to rub out the bevels fairly quickly and evenly. Don't get me wrong, I'll use a beveled stamp on some projects. It really just depends on who it's for or the value you want placed on it if you're selling it. Well, thanks for watching. Hopefully you got something out of this video. Hit the like button to help support the channel, and subscribe for more content.